Hello and welcome to Build a 100K Pipeline in 90 Days video series. My name is CJ and I'm a training coordinator with the tech training team at Keller Williams. And whether you're a new agent to Keller Williams or agent just discovering command, agents just like you are using command to power their business. Now, it all starts with getting in the habit of small, consistent steps. So what I can promise you is I'm going to be speaking and teaching to principles and models that are proven and have produced countless millionaire real estate agents. So if you're engaged in completing the tasks laid out in these videos, this is going to be a roadmap to your success. Now, what is command? Well, Gary Keller, who's the founder of the company, he wrote a book. That book is called The Millionaire Real Estate Agent Book. And well, Command was built from the systems and models from this very book here. And this book's all about just boosting your productivity as an agent. Now, the first task that we're going to actually complete together is setting up your KW marketing identity within your Command account, which this is going to be a huge part setting up a a good foundation for you. Now, the marketing profile helps you create marketing content easier and faster. It's really a powerful template that's going to be used on paid ad content, offer summaries, your KW agent site, and much more. So really completing this now will set you up for success as we go down the road here. So first things first, what we're going to talk about and show you here is how to get signed in. So you can go to agent.kw.com. It'll probably prompt you to sign in. Or bring you straight into your account, as we can see here. So the first place I'm going to actually go from here is going to be our settings. This is how we get to the marketing profile. So I'm going to click on my name or face on the right-hand side of the screen. And I'm going to click on settings. Now, once I'm in settings, this is the area we're going to see here. On the left-hand side, we're going to go to connect settings here. And we'll see marketing profile. We'll click on marketing profile. And we'll see this area here. Now, let's quickly go through this. So at the top here, we have an area. Uh, we want to make sure that that's toggled on that green dot there. It says information uh, branded to my agent site. That's going to allow us to take this information and put it on our KW agent site uh, to help us with our marketing. It's going to pull straight from this content here. Uh, We're going to see our awesome, beautiful headshot photos, professional photos that we got created. We can plug that into this area here. It will let you know the format size being JPEG or PNG and recommended size so it's not pixelated. We can do that same thing if you're on a team. You can plug in your team logo here. As we go down, we see basic information, first name, last name, uh, agent license number. It's going to be an optional field, but you can plug it in. And it's going to have a slogan. Now, this is a required field. Now, if you're not sure what your slogan is, you can put agent of choice. That's my example I like to put in. Uh, you can always come back into this area later. Once you know what that slogan is, you want to change it, uh, you have that option there. As we go down here, we're going to see a bio. This is where you're going to plug in who you are, maybe some personal life stuff, maybe why you got into business, how you operate uh, as a real estate agent, uh, You know, are you passionate about people, maybe what you did before you got into real estate. Uh, all of that can be applied here. We're going to plug in our mobile phone, office phone. Office phone could also be a business line or business phone that you use, work phone that you use. Or if you just want to use your market center's phone number, you can plug that in here as well. Email and then website. Typically, people put their KW agent sites in here. Uh, or if you have a website that you created that's a one-off site, uh, you can plug that into here as well. Market center or brokerage information. Um, we're going to plug in that DBA logo or market center lo- uh Logo, we can plug that in here. If you're not sure, there is a link here that we can go to to plug that in. As we go down here, frequently asked question this compliance area. So some of your market centers will require a footer text or links or images into this compliance area. If you're not sure, just check in with your market center. They're going to have the answers on uh, what should be applied in this area. At the bottom, towards the bottom here, we have our social media area. This can be an uh, an optional area, but very powerful. So if you have a Facebook business page or Twitter, Instagram, or YouTube channel you use to market your business, or even a LinkedIn, um, you can just copy and paste whatever is in the browser and plug it in here. Uh, cool. One of the cool things here is that this information will sync over to your KW agent site. So if someone's on that site, they can go to one of your other social media platforms from there, really helping your uh, business become more marketable there. And at the very bottom, we have the Google Analytics ID. 
best thing to kind of explain this is uh, this will allow you to become more searchable, your business, your brand, as people are searching on Google. And you can also track that information through that feature as well. All right. And at the bottom, we're going to make sure we click save and save that information. Now that we've established your marketing identity, we can get you started towards closing your first deal. Exciting, right? So in the next video, what I'm going to be showing you is the, the most important piece of your business, which is going to be your database. So without this piece, you won't have the foundation needed to build a strong business. So I'll see you back for the next video so we can stay on the roadmap to success and build a strong business for you. And if you have any questions about this functionality or any features that I talked about, please email us at learncommand at kw.com. All right, we'll see you for the next video.